so these past two weeks of Naruto Shippuden, we've actually had canon episodes, so briefly to go into last week's episode, for the most part, a lot of it was mainly focused on Sakura and Obito trying to save Sasuke, and it gave us a Sakura x Sasuke moment, that was one of the main things about last week's episode, a little bit more, it's just Naruto and Kaguya going at it, but it was an okay episode for the most part, it had, a, you know, a couple flashbacks here or there, but it wasn't overbearing, this week's episode, however, it was like, I don't even know, a good 70% of it mainly focusing on flashbacks that we've seen before it was almost as if they took pieces and chunks of different episodes and just smacked it together that were very recent like the stuff with Obito and Guy going at it when they were younger in the tuning exams and all the Ren shit I was like yo we just got back to canon and now we got to see more flashbacks honestly the Naruto Shibuden anime with stuff like this it almost feels horrendous it almost feels downright disrespectful with what they do because it's like how much more are you going to stretch this shit out it wasn't until pretty much the end of the episode where kakashi and obito were like trying to move in the gravity to jump in front of naruto and sasuke that the episode actually moved other than that it was like we got to see rin again we got to see all that again and i get it that they were trying to push the emotional stuff and it's like it's been a while so let's remind you guys exactly why is it that obito and kakashi got here but really like 80 percent 70 percent of the episode was mainly obito thinking back about his life and i think based on the preview for next week they're gonna do the same thing prior to the finale of all this obito shit and it's like we don't need all this we're like 400 and something episodes in we've seen it time and time again you gave us countless filler episodes countless flashbacks we fucking get it obito went through hell he made mistakes he became a piece of shit and now he's trying to get redemption we don't need the force because when you try to force these feels and it just comes like at once of like shit that we've seen time and time again it just feels like bullshit and feels annoying and that's what i felt like a lot of this episode like with the rin stuff and everything is like i've seen it time and time again you literally just took chunks of episodes and try to make it passing it off as like oh it's new shit but no no so the latest episode of naruto she put in really wasn't feeling it up until the end and by the end i'm like oh hey there's a couple of new minutes of decent you know new material and stuff like that but everything else is like you just smacking me in the face with flashbacks and filler after we just got out of filler and flashback city you get what i'm saying so yeah honestly i would argue that last week's episode pretty damn good episode i would say maybe like a seven out of ten you know naruto versus kaguya a lot of good stuff and i mean the animation for the latest episode was kind of weird because the slow motion stuff it kind of worked kind of didn't with Obito and Kakashi moving in slow motion and shit like that but when there was other little tidbits like Naruto and Kaguya going at it and kind of seeing a little bit more of Naruto's strategic side of him tricking Kaguya and shit like that pretty cool stuff but again it was just the latest episode with all the flashbacks and filler is really what just kind of like cut everything in and uh most of it was canon flashbacks and shit like that again the past were written and whatever but it's just it's unnecessary like honestly if you're gonna kill this motherfucker oh we told just kill the motherfucker stop reminding us we get it yeah latest episode of naruto she went in uh, i would say like you skip around the episode maybe just skip around a little bit if you've seen it before say okay let me keep going and then get to the bits where it's like oh we're back to the present timeline oh shit is going down because if not you're gonna just get annoyed honestly you're gonna get annoyed of seeing the same shit they've seen time and time again and yeah it's obito stuff like i don't even know if the japanese realize how much a lot of people really don't but then again i don't know what the japanese audience feels like because i don't know how they feel about obito but yeah a lot of people aren't really fond of the dude don't get me wrong i feel bad for him i feel bad because i look at him and i see like he's one hell of a piece of shit that made a lot of fucked up decisions but ultimately now he's trying to do the right thing in the end and it's like you know i feel kind of bad for the dude he, he's just a fucked up individual or whatever but yeah f forcing all this shit down our throats is, is not cool bro latest episode of naruto shippuden was not cool let me know what you guys think though how did you feel about the last week's episode of naruto shippuden what do you think about that sasuke x sakura moment do you feel as though sasuke was really into it he was like yeah sakura saved me and also getting to see his new ability as well that he can you know transport shit or whatever and that's how he got through the hole just in time like sasuke he never misses the hole and what do you think about the latest episode where you just like oh when you saw the flashback and filler regarding obito's past and how did you feel about the ending like honestly the ending of the episode pretty cool stuff but it didn't make up for like 70 percent of the episode being the same shit we've seen time and time again any overall thoughts but thanks for watching hope you enjoyed if you liked anything i had to say or enjoyed the video drop me a like i'd greatly appreciate it and if you want more from me make sure to subscribe follow me on twitter instagram and stalk my facebook to get more when the video ends i'm from world and as always people have an awesome day